Hello, and welcome to The Angry Sniper, episode number 77. Oh, what a war zone this was. <laughs> this is a war zone of the type that you barely see these days. It's got end-to-end -end action, and an ending which is quite rare. Yeah, at least I like to think so. It was more common back in the day, you know. <laughs> but I'm not going to give anything away. Hopefully not, anyway. Um, but yes. Um, there is another reason for loading this. Um, a while ago, there was a cursed shot ball. And it was Yadira on his um, sniper, uh, Mistina, and Winchester and myself, so three snipers, in a cursed shot ball. And he had quite a good game. He he scored two, and he set me up for me to score. Uh, just an all-round good game. And I wasn't recording. <laughs> and the comment was, of course, um, do a bit bad by me. Um, I'll come back to that. Now, I think I've got the ball carrier stunned there. Um, I planned to stun him as he came across the fire, but completely miss targeted him <laughs> I've always said my targeting leaves a lot to be desired sometimes and that I think is a prime example of what <laughs> but anyway as I was saying before I rudely interrupted myself um yeah so there's a war zone which um uh, you never did quite well in and I wasn't recording and he turned around and said it's typical um, every time he has a good game I'm not recording <laughs> So, I think he had um, um, a good game. There's one particular clip he does, which I happen to like, you know. Um, so, there you go, dude. Don't say I don't do anything for you. <laughs> um, so, yeah, this is the second war zone I've, um, I've loaded with this uh, different spec of mine. Um, I'll put another link in the description below to the... Go to the end of the vid of in the link in the description below. I thought I said that, <laughs> and you'll see the spec I've got. You know, um, should probably uh, do one of those um, utility calculator things. But anyway, sorry. Um, yeah, I'm looking for a, a place to pass. Trying to keep tabs, you know. Um, it's a shame I wasn't on voice comm there, to be honest, because I could have turned around and said, Whoa, stop, you do it. I'm going to pass. You know. <laughs> but, no worries. It's turned out to be a fair bit of fun anyway. Now, I don't do a good job of it, but... Look at the amount of red people in there. Engineering sniper. Loads of groups, enemy players in the same spot. That's asking for a bit of AOE damage, you know. <laughs> so, yeah, I'll do a bit too much suppressive fire for my liking. Um, yes, funny. Yes. Ever since I've done that, I think it's the pure efficiency, isn't it? The, t the plus 25 to suppressive fire damage. I've tested it out. I, I have found myself using it a lot more. Um, but I, I did mess up that. I should have put plasma probe down first then orbital strike, and then blasted um, suppressive fire. But in that situation, it does nothing. Um, uh, a lot of the players in there, I think, were tank spec. Um, because it's pretty standard, I think, these days for assassins, paratechs, and, drug and juggernaut. Oh, good little clip here. Almost got it. <laughs> There's that particular um, person there. I've got no idea where he goes. Um, it's kind of... I see someone beside me, and then he just suddenly vanishes. It's kind of... I've watched it back a couple of times, and still haven't worked out where he's very well gone. <laughs> I do think I did a couple of wrong skills there, you know. Um, I don't think I could have done too much to prevent that, but I do think I could have done better... Um, I thought perhaps um, um, I should have uh, used 
uh, grenade on the first the one which I used cover pulse on to keep him in the fire. That would have allowed me to use cover pulse on that bloody sage. Um, because two quick uh, scores for them. There. You know, whatever. Plenty of time left in the game. <laughs> It's one of these things I do enjoy Hutball, you know, is there's no way the Kesh Hutball is anywhere near as good. It's, I know what they were trying to do, but it just didn't work. I mean, I love Covered Escape in, in this. It's, um, in one respect, as a sniper and our utilities in the way we use them, I think it is a the best war zone in one respect to train you how to use your defensive skills in a way which don't necessarily have any defensive value in it you know like cover pulse and uh, the knockback on so to shots for the fire um, you know debilitate and leg shot for that matter as well you know and but we can use covered escape for this I just think it's very good for that. It, uh, occasionally you will have a couple of snipers posting on, on the Star Wars forums saying, oh, you know, um, I don't like Hutball. And it's kind of, what? <laughs> Say again? I don't quite understand that, dude. How can you be a sniper and not like this particular map? You know, even if you're a marksman sniper or engineering or violence, whatever, and you don't play the way I do, you know, you just um, try to stay in mid and just attack anything that goes. Hey, you know, not my style, but each to their own, which is fine. It's kind of, how can you not find it fun? <laughs> it's, I don't know, it just... I, I just don't understand it. <laughs> you know, a long time ago, I do actually remember... Um, I think it was Agent Smith from Servants of None. Um, very good operative. Um, left at around the time so Servants of None ended. And uh, he turned around and said um, he was one of the few concealment specs at that particular time. Um, I think he left before the first server merges. Came back briefly but didn't stay very long. And uh, he turned around and said he thought... That the spec wasn't that great. But of course, back in those days, the level cap was 50 and operatives didn't have the double ball. A bit like the snipers, you know. So he used to spend the entire war zone, I think he said, uh, running around, trying to keep up with people and wasn't able to. <laughs> and then I think what operatives can do these days, it's kind of completely changed the way they're played in this particular map. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, that's funny. Now, he was a good operative, he was. It's, um, had a tendency to rage, I think, a couple of times, but he was a good guy. He knew his class, you know. <laughs> now, at this particular stage, I know um, I'm not going to be able to stop him, but I thought I'd give it a try anyway. But, yeah, yeah so far, it's, it's been a, quite a good war zone. It's kind of, they've matched us for scoring and so forth, and, you know, it's been great. I mean, there's far too many times, I think, that um, it's far too many DPS tunnel games where no one does anything, no one's calls because they're just busy killing each other, and or it's been a complete, a total bite wash. Um... So, I think, yeah, this was a very welcome change. Wasn't sure whether Yadira was able to pass there or not, but... Um, in hindsight, that wasn't the best of uh, things, places to put him, really. <laughs> uh, I mean, the cover pulse. To just put him down there with Yadira. But, deja vu. <laughs> Where have I seen this before? Bit of diversion there to uh, help 
You could do it a bit, you know. I did that covered escape there to help root him in place so I can do my AoE. <laughs> I mean, when you got this kind of thing going on, apart from AOE, Diversion, um, Shield, Ballistic Shield, which I haven't actually used yet, Naughty Me, <laughs> and AOE stuff, there's not much a sniper can do to help. It's just a shame in this particular bit, you've got a lot of... Oh, I think they had uh, at least three people which were in tank spec. Um... So, all the damage I do on AoE was never going to be that much at all, you know. <laughs> Managed to escape a bit, but it, it is 4 4. Now, in this respect, it's something. Um, I probably should have uh, kept on to the ball at that point, you know, because I've got my covered escape back. I could have easily gone over it like that with the ball, but yeah. <laughs> One minute left, 4-4, four, four. can we keep hold of the ball? A pass has been done. He's up there by himself, no, he's knocked down again. <laughs> This has been a fun game, but he's uh, going down. Nope, he's up again. 30 seconds left, so I can see his health is going. And hey, we've won. 30 seconds left. <laughs> but is it over? Oop, they've got the ball. <laughs> Use my um, scatter bombs, covered escape to root him for two seconds. And yay, nice one. <laughs> that was a good fun game. And there hasn't been that many games quite like this one. Not because of the damage, which means nothing. But how it played out, how it was done, the ending. I like it. It was fun. This <laughs> keep sniping, have fun, and I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did playing it. <laughs> that was good. See you again, folks. Have fun.